the African jackass penguins are really neat. Uh, the fact that you can go right up to the beach and just kind of hang out with them, lay down as they're just walk past, and they do this funny kind of dwaddle thing. It's also really cool that uh, they built a bunch of boardwalks through there, so you can really get uh, ideas to how critical that habitat is for that population of the penguins. And uh, in general, you know, I think um, most people think penguins are these larger animals, but in fact, they're quite tiny. Uh, they're only you know, about a foot and a half tall, uh, but they're uh, very adorable and really cool to get that close up to them. Penguins are, are associated usually with cold weather climates, so it's fairly rare to see them in a, in a place so warm as South Africa. The daily temperatures, even here in the wintertime, are very, very comfortable. Uh, so it's surprising to see them here, but uh, it's kind of one of the treats of being in Cape Town is going to Boulders Beach. I thought the Cape of Good Hope was really interesting because of the historical significance. Growing up in, in history class, learning all about the various explorers, particularly the Portuguese explorers, and thinking about what it must have been like to round that corner and finally realize that you're starting to get around the southern tip of Africa. But uh, you know, what's funny about being there, of course, is that it's not the actual southernmost point in Africa. That title belongs to uh, Point Gullis, which is uh, about 160 kilometers just to the west. Uh, although it is very neat to think about kind of what's, um, you know, the fact that your Atlantic Ocean, big Atlantic Ocean, and your big warm Indian Ocean are both meeting uh, very close to this point here. Cape Point in particular is just the point itself is worth seeing. It's these uh, beautiful sedimentary layers of granite followed by some sandstone and then a lot of um, kind of brushy vegetation in the area. The old lighthouse is about 250 meters off of or above the ocean so you just have this great vista of, uh, all around you and um, the landscape there is it's absolutely phenomenal it's, and you can kind of stroll out to the very end of Cape Point and just get this amazing vista looking towards south. Cape Town is definitely, from what I've seen, the most beautiful city in South Africa. It's located right at the base of Table Mountain, and Table Mountain is 3,000 vertical feet, and it just kind of sits above town. It uh, really opens itself up for some nice hiking and some trail running. Uh, it's also a very kind of metro in its feeling, a very pedestrian friendly, lots of people uh, walking everywhere, and lots of uh, really good restaurants and cute cafes.